Our experience yet now has been uh, very wonderful. The people of Japan are very kind and helpful. I really look forward uh, to meet more people and uh, in the academic sector as well. I really hope I get to know a lot. It was a great experience today meeting everyone. The fellow students will be working with me together over here. It's good to know other culture, and I'm excited for beginning my research work here. Like I applied to the KU Star program because my interest in academia aligned with what this program was offering, and. For anyone who wants to go into academia, this is like the stepping stone. They understand how research is done and how a PhD is going to be. At Kyoto University, I wasn't just awarded an opportunity to conduct research. I was awarded with an opportunity to explore my academic interests. The support from the professors, the availability of so many resources allowed me to explore where I wanted to head in my academic career in a way where I don't think it would have been possible elsewhere. Kyoto University is amazing to take your academic exploration further and I think I am able to think clearly more about my future research after coming to Kyoto University. My lab mates were really supportive and uh, entertained the silliest of doubts that I ever had. They were uh, very supportive of me and on Fridays we used to go out together to eat so we even bonded really well. Apart from that, uh, the Shimadzu Corporation visit, it was really eye-opening, getting to hear from the experts themselves firsthand. Uh, so we saw a whole uh, array of technological devices, many of them which I didn't even know existed. So it uh, took my knowledge level about uh, technology in Japan uh, way up. So if you are unsure what to do in summer, KU Star program is definitely uh, the best things you could do in your summer. Uh, the two months have been a wonderful journey. I have enjoyed the food, the culture, the people are so kind. I would surely love to come back to Japan again and study further here. Yeah, it, was, it has been a wonderful experience overall. And of course, uh, I enjoyed the cultural experience in Japan as well. Um, you know, we tried out a lot of food, we tried out a lot of... Uh, we, we went to a lot of places and we enjoyed ourselves thoroughly. And in fact, uh, so the, the four of us are here and uh, one of us is uh, Aditya, he went back early. But the five of us, we have really become like family and uh, we toured a lot of places together. Yes. Everything we did was together. So, yeah, I'm really glad I found the four of them. <laughs> So yeah, it's been a, it's been an amazing experience. And uh, these two months has been incredible. I mean, I lot I learned a lot about uh, uh, Japan interculture and uh, about myself as well. Uh, this is first time me being away from home, so it was totally new, and I'm so grateful that it was Kyoto University. And uh, I learned a lot because. Um, uh, in terms of research, like my professors, the PhDs who guided me, they were really patient and that really encouraged me to work a lot more and uh, if not for this opportunity, I think it would have been, uh, it would have taken a lot more time to actually figure out things. So I'm really grateful for this opportunity. So this two months has been like uh, really something special that I would remember in my whole life. Uh, it would, uh, it like really helped me to grow both personally as well as professionally. So I would like to come back to Japan as well as to Kyoto University to pursue my like further education and everything. So I'm grateful to everyone behind this KU Star program. So thank you so much. What I have done in this two months. So as far as my question is concerned, I worked on uh, wide band gap pro sky solar cells. Specifically talking about, I have tried to analyze the impact of thiocyanates and chlorides on wide band gap pro sky solar cells. So, in a broader sense or in a layman language, if I have to say, this project deals with the with op from optimizing such devices which aims to harness the high energy photon coming from the sun radiation and to convert them into the fruitful electrical energy. And uh, during this project, as this pro project progresses, I learned a lot many techniques, advanced fabrication as well as the characterization techniques. Coming to the role of my lab members, these are brilliant, literally they are brilliant because they helped me a lot in not in a sense only helping me academically but also uh, extracurricular as well. So because I was new to this lab 
and uh, so many things were new to me so it was very difficult for a person to survive in a lab without any uh, backup support or something but these members really make me come make me feel comfortable and work together so those who are thinking to come to japan as in the q star program i strongly recommend you please join and have a look the kyoto university is full of research opportunities full of top notch instruments full of uh, helpful people all together it's a full package you should definitely consider to join here thank you so much